Today we're going to make Carolina style cornbread. This is Jackie from Motherwise, and I teach mothers and others how to get dinner on the table quickly, easily, and frugally. So let's go over our ingredients list. You'll need two cups of cornmeal, a teaspoon of baking soda, a teaspoon of salt, two teaspoons of baking powder, one egg, and a cup of buttermilk and lemon juice and I'll show you how to doctor it up. A cast iron pan is also essential for Carolina cornbread. But if you don't have one, you can use whatever you've got. So the first thing I'm going to do is add some oil to my pan. I've just got some light olive oil and I'm going to add two tablespoons or somewhere thereabouts to my pan. Swirl it around and put it in the oven. The oven needs to be on 400 and I've already set that. Next we need to make our buttermilk. So let me show you how. So I'm going to take a tablespoon of lemon juice. And add it to my measuring cup. And then I'm going to fill my measuring cup up to the top with milk. Trying to pour it where the you can see the lemon juice so that it sort of mixes up. Now I'm going to set this aside and wait five minutes. This is my baking soda. This is a recycled jar. This is not the lid that came on this jar, but it fits. So, I put my food in glass jars because it protects it. I have ants around here and sometimes they get in the house and I don't want them in my food. Plus, baking soda is, it absorbs odors and I don't want what goes in my food to absorb odors. So I put it in this glass jar. So, one teaspoon of baking soda, one teaspoon of salt, this is Redmond sea salt, two teaspoons of baking powder, I'm going to mix it with a whisk. The cornmeal that I am using is a local brand from North Carolina and it's very fine you can also buy coarse cornmeal and a medium grind just find what you like this is very fine so it comes out more like cake or or biscuits with a fine flour i like it both ways next i'm going to add my egg And my buttermilk. And we're going to stir. Make sure you get it stirred up on the bottom so it's not dry down there. Next, I'm going to take my hot oil from my pan. And add it to my cornmeal. And stir that up. Now I'm going to scrape it down and add it to my pan. Put it in the oven for 25 to 35 minutes until it's brown on top. This recipe goes with the dried beans we made last week. And it also makes great cornbread stuffing for Thanksgiving. If you like this content, don't forget to like and subscribe. 
and hit the bell to be notified every time I release a video. This is Jackie from Otherwise, and remember, dinner's at 6. Let me know in the comments how you like your cornbread.